Hi everyone and welcome back. So in this video I'll tell you guys how to enable irregular heart rhythm notifications on your Galaxy Watch. Irregular heart rhythm notification is a system that was recently announced by Samsung with One UI 5. It is available out of the box on Galaxy Watch 6 in supported countries. But Galaxy Watch 5 and 4 will be getting it too with One UI 5 update. Anyways to enable this notification, make sure apps on your watch and phone are up to date. And I'm talking about Samsung Health Monitor app on your phone and watch and mod ones if you're using those. I'm using mod apps on my Galaxy watch and phone so I'll be updating them. Once again link for downloading them is down in description. So make sure to check them out. Either you can download them using Dante's SHM mod companion app. Here in this app under home section, first you have to download this file. This is the phone app that you have to update to the latest version. Right now the latest version for this app is 1.2.1.0009. In the same way you have to download watch SHM app. And this app has to be installed on your watch. If you already have SHM app installed, you can just install this to get to the latest version. And if you don't know how to install this on your watch, using companion app that I have right now, just check out the link down in description that explains in a step by step process on how to install this mod SHM app on your Galaxy Watch. Once you have updated these apps on your phone and on your watch, you have to take an ECG. Once ECG is completed on your watch, open phone SHM app. Under ECG section, you will see this banner that says Enable Irregular Heart Rhythm Notification System. You can read more information here like how it will work and that's it. Now your watch will look for irregular heart rhythm in the background and whenever it detects an irregular heart rhythm, you will get a notification to perform an ECG using your Galaxy watch. In this way you can see if you have an atrial fibrillation or sinus rhythm. So check it out and make sure to subscribe as I'll be posting more cool updates regarding Galaxy Watch. And with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye bye.